town of Harvard, Massachusetts has a pretty classic 4th of July celebration with the parade and antique cars and then a series of field events which include um, an egg toss and a greased pole and an apple, bobbing for apples, mm. and a popping contest. And so that was where my song came in. Well, Harvard is so beautiful, but you're also a singer and songwriter. You draw a lot of inspiration from lived experiences. So tell us what inspired you to write a song about a pie eating contest. So um, in my youth, I was the two time winner of my town's hey. pie eating contest. Wow. Um, yes, I'm very proud of that fact. <laughs> you should be. Uh, so, but when I was no longer quite so youthful, um, I decided that as a grown up, I wanted to enter the pie eating contest again. And so I did. And so the song that I wrote is about that. Um, but as I wrote, the song, I realized that it was so much more about just the pie eating contest. It was really just about kind of being willing to get out of your comfort zone and do things that feel scary sometimes. You're not going to be a contestant, but you're actually going to be a judge this year. I this is this is a, a big judge. honor, Aaron. <laughs> I kind of want to compete. That. I well, think sure. I, I think you should. Yeah. Judging is critical, though. Judging is critical. Yeah. You're looking for speed, mostly. Ah, it's, speed. Yeah, this is a speed and not quantity pie eating contest. Mm. Okay, so there's no real technique then that you're. Oh, there judging. is. Oh, there is. There yes, is. You, you won. What's the I, technique to winning? I don't think I want to divulge that on <laughs> television. Um, but it, there is absolutely a technique that I use that is time honored and wow. that I used to win. Well, you went back to back. I mean, exactly. clearly it's effective. There you go. Well, what tips could you share for people who will be in your shoes at the contest this year or any pie eating contest? I feel like it's a bucket list item, being a pie I eating do. contest. I think, I think you need to bring your A game. I think you need to be ready to just focus on the pie and be the pie. Skip a meal. Be the two, pie. Yes. Be the, the pie. pie. All right, so this song is, as I just said, we listened to it. Uh, it's yeah, sincere, it's whimsical, it is lovely. Here's a quick sneak peek of it. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you a true tale not so long ago. Fourth of July, sun was high, flags waving slow. My whole hometown had gathered for a wholesome day of fun. A big parade, some lemonade, and some games for everyone. I walked on by the egg toss and the children's happy cries. Left behind the greased pole to a soul with stronger thighs. Cause a table full of cherry pies was where I had to be. And a tiny voice inside my head was calling out to me. Eat the pie, eat the pie. Don't care if they might point and stare, don't let them ask you why. Cause that sweetness brings a sweetness that money just can't buy. I'm telling you, go on and eat the pie. Well, my town's pie eating contest has been a point of pride for me. I won it twice in middle school at 12 and then 13. For a nerdy, bookish weirdo who was cut from every team. The thought of winning any ribbon was a kind of fever dream. Now a fully grown up woman should have hobbies, I suppose. But eating pie in record time might not be one of those. So I turned away, maintaining my respectable veneer. But still that tiny voice went on and whispered in my ear, eat the pie. Eat the pie. Don't care if they might point and stare, don't let them ask you why. Cause that sweetness brings a sweetness that money just can't buy. I'm telling you, go on and eat the pie. And as I hovered by the entrance, I found myself impressed by the existential crisis that had bloomed within my breast. Would I let other people's shoulds and shouldn'ts riddle me with doubt? Would I give in to what was safe and let the whole world count me out? Don't count me out. So I walked up to that table, took my place behind a pie. So brawny guys twice my size arranged on either side. The town citizen of note who was proud to play his part. Shushed the crowd till they were silent, then proclaimed that we could start. The competitors ate valiantly and rushed to cram it in. Rumors ricocheted as people wondered who would win. Caught up in the moment and the crowd's excited shrieks. 
I open wide, shove the pie inside with the extra in my cheeks. I ate the pie, the whole damn pie. And the town folk raised a cheer as I held that blue ribbon high. Cause that sweetness brings a sweetness that money just can't buy. I'm telling you if fate provides a chance for you to feel alive. Don't worry if it's right for you or what you should and should not do. Say yes and open wide and eat the pie.